on now to the race for the White House and a new ABC News Washington Post poll out just this morning shows President Obama has a narrow lead just before the first crucial debate coming up this Wednesday. In a moment, we're going to have former California Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger weigh in on the politics of all this. But it is your voice, your vote. And ABC's David Muir is here now with the very latest on this poll. Good morning to you, David. Morning, Elizabeth. Great to see you. This is still a very tight race. In fact, our new poll shows President Obama leads by just two points among likely voters. Break out the key battleground states and the president's lead does widen somewhat. And this morning, just two days before that big debate, who do voters think will win? Hello, Las Vegas! Overnight in Las Vegas, the president playing the odds, talking predictions about the first all-important debate. I know folks in the media are speculating already on who's going to have the best zingers. No, no, Governor Romney, he's, he's a good debater. The president heading into days of intense debate practice, just as our new ABC News Washington Post poll shows him with that razor-thin lead among likely voters. The gap does break wide open when voters are asked who they expect to win. 63% of voters told us they think the president will win in November. As for the all-important debates, 56% say they expect the president to win. Both campaigns deep in debate prep, both trying to lower expectations. All right. With one very notable exception, Republican Chris Christie telling George, expect a different race after the debate. When we get to Thursday morning, George, all you're going to be shaking your head saying it's a brand new race. And if the president argues Romney wants to cut taxes for the rich, Christie's suggested response? Stop lying, Mr. President. Where's the lie there? But he, Governor Romney's not talking about more tax cuts for the wealthy. In fact, what he said is that the wealthy will pay just as much under a Romney administration as they pay but today. Romney does say he would lower tax rates across the board, but he would also eliminate common deductions, too. And as our new poll shows, with a majority expecting the president to win the debate, the president's focus will be to avoid unforced errors. Like President George H.W. Bush back in 1992 caught checking his watch, or Vice President Al Gore taking that awkward step toward then-Governor George W. Bush. And I believe I can. All right. So many believe that Al Gore had invaded George Bush's personal space right there. And we had some fun in our new ABC News Washington Post poll asking, who would you like to see on Dancing with the Stars? 51% said the president, 26% said Romney. But we also asked this, who would you trust to babysit your children? Elizabeth, listen to this. Mm -hmm. Dead even, both at 41%. I'm not surprised by that. Yeah. One is a good father, the Get other the good grandfather, grandfather yeah. and father. So the likability issue is so important. Thanks, David. You bet.